Hey guys, this is Lee here. And in this video, it's gonna be a little bit different. I want to just pay tribute to a person who was very inspiring with sailing. His name is Davison Nagel. I didn't know Davison Nagel personally, but I thought I did because he created a Facebook page called the, it's called the Snark Sunfish Phantom Laser Beach Cat Small Boat Sailing Page. And he wanted to be all inclusive. And there was a post today that I saw and his daughter was on the uh, Facebook page and and she regret regrettably said how um, Davison passed away suddenly of a heart attack. Now, I, I didn't know Davison personally. However, he created this page. I got on the page because he liked to sail. And when I saw his posts and his videos, I don't know how old he was. He was probably about my age or probably in the mid fifties, but his passion was infectious. It really was infectious that he sailed, he didn't sail a sunfish, he sailed a, a Jetwind 14, he sailed a Phantom, um, a mini fish, but he sailed a lot. He's from Minnesota, a lake in Minnesota, one of the 10,000 lakes in Minnesota, and he posted constantly and he was really about being inclusive and he just sailed his, he just shared his love for sailing. And I really connected with Davison and, you know, every once in a while I'll say, wow, do you always have wind in your lake? And he would make a comment, sure, maybe, I don't know. Um, and then one of the posts he had was just of his jet wind, red jet wind 14 next to the shore on the shoreline and he would open up his his cooler and he would open it up and then he would grab a cores out of there and he'd open it up and that was that was it but uh it was really he was really famous or mini famous whatever you want to call it that he had his camera on the end of his boom and he just sailed and he sailed fast and he, he reached back and forth and and he just had a good time. And that's what Davison was all about. He loved to go sailing. His daughter said on his his po on, on the post that she wrote that he was an he was an adventurous person. He loved to sail and he loved to do adventures and things like that. I didn't know him that well other than his post that he put up. He created the site back probably a year ago during the pandemic and it was inspiring to see a man like this take a simple sailboat like a jet wind or a sailfish or a phantom and go race around the lake. And then he took his GPS on his phone and he would track his course and he would post it. And it was really interesting, not because of he was the fastest sailor, even though he was going really fast. It was. He, he just had fun. And for me, I'm a serious sailor. I travel all right around the world and things like that. But to see Davison, Davison Nagel, to just be really pure at enjoying the moment, taking his, his time and really sharing his joy in sailing. <laughs> And it didn't matter if his boat was 100% flat. He was having so much fun. And, and for me, I got joy out of seeing him sail. And I said, wow, I, you know, when, when I grow up, I want to be like you. And so for Davison, I, I appreciate what you did for the sailing community. And you posted and you created this this small sailboat vlog on, um, on Facebook. And, you know, we're gonna miss you. And, and everyone's gonna miss you. And thanks for the 
2,000 subscribers to your to your vlog, and you really made you really made a difference. Thanks. <laughs> Thank <laughs> you.